All right, YouTube, here we are again with another video for this Gladiator Rubicon. Uh, today, what we're gonna be doing is adjusting these fog slash driving lights. Uh, I don't really call them fog lights because they're white and I think fog lights are yellow, green color. So I call them driving lights because they're white. I have the LED package. So these are the LEDs and a lot of people don't know how to adjust these. So let's get started. So just real quick, why I want to adjust these is it seems like I, I know that all this is supposed to be adjusted from the factory and it's supposed to be good but my back window is not supposed to be leaking water from the factory either. So what I'm saying is stuff happens. Sometimes they're a little high, sometimes they're a little low. Um, my headlights seem like they're a tad low uh, compared to other vehicles that I've driven. Uh, you have to be careful when you adjust those. These fog lights are extremely low or driving lights, whatever you want to call them. They seem to shine pretty much directly in front of the vehicle. So I'm gonna raise them up just a little bit. I know they're supposed to be lower than the headlights. Uh, they give a nice wide beam pattern. So I'm just gonna adjust them just a hair up to get them just a little farther up since I consider them driving lights more than fog lights. So the issue that we have is most people don't know how to adjust these or think they're not adjustable. So what I've done is I've backed up uh, just enough to be able to see the beam and see how it moves back and forth. And this is what you're gonna need to do your adjustment, if it'll focus. All right, just a little stubby, come on, stubby screwdriver Phillips head to stick into the back. So let's go over how we're gonna get the lights to come on and just have the running lights on. So what you'll have to do is come into your Jeep, and you're gonna push this start button twice, get it to the run position. Then I keep my headlights in auto, so you'll go right here. And if your running lights are on, then you'll see the running lights are on by themselves without the headlights. If you don't have them on, then this top button right here, that's what turns them on. So now you can see I just have the running lights on by themselves. So we'll walk around to the front and right here on the light, this right here, you just stick your screwdriver in there and turning it to the left on the driver's side raises them up. So let's look, that's the factory. So just a hair, we'll raise that up. And then we'll come around to the other side here same little adjuster, Let's stick it in. Again, turn it to the left, raise it up just a hair. So there we go. It's just a little above the trim board here. Like I said, you don't wanna raise these up too far. You wanna do just a little and then drive it at night and make sure it's what you want and that you're not blinding anybody. That little bit of an adjustment shouldn't be any kind of an issue. And it's that simple. Again, this is with the LED light kit. 2020, probably all the way through 2022 now, uh, Gladiator, Rubicon, and the uh, Wrangler. Rubicon and probably whatever models that have the LED light kit. <clears throat> this right here is gonna be the steel bumper option, but it's gonna be the same lights if you have the standard bumper. So that's how to adjust your driving light slash fog light, whatever you wanna call it, on your Jeep. Hope this helps some folks out. Remember to share this video if you think it helps somebody out that's looking for this on how to do this on their Jeep. Thanks for watching, more videos to come. Subscribe if you haven't. Make sure the bell's turned on. All that good junk. Thanks.